taking a trip down to Freeport, Texas to stay at the Beachfront RV Resort. We're going to meet K&R Destinations and Donovan and Jody of RV on the Wayside. Carrie, you want to say something? <laughs> That'll work. friends. Beachfront RV Resort in Surfside Beach, Texas is an interesting place to park your RV and hang out at the beach. The number one luxury of this RV park is that you do not have to cross the highway when you want to go to the beach. There is a restaurant and bar on property, but if a lot of noise is an issue for you, you might not want to be here on a Saturday night. We were there on a Saturday night and this place was jamming. That's not too much of a concern for us. I got into the shower about midnight and I remember the vent over the shower was vibrating to the bass coming off of where the live band was playing. Our girls absolutely loved being able to go to the beach each day and do some digging and building some sandcastles. Texas beaches are a bit unique in the fact that they allow people to drive on the beach, or at least in this area they do. I know a lot of Texans are very proud of the fact that they can drive on the beach, but I did feel like it could raise some safety concerns with the kiddos playing out there. As well as, in the afternoon, there was so much dust kicked up, I felt like I was back in Kandahar in Afghanistan. I'm already off to a good start. An excellent start. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna make you mad at me. I have no ketchup. Oh, I'm not, I don't care. That's okay. We don't okay. put nothing on nothing anyway. We just we, have, uh, we get so excited about food we just eat. <laughs> Actually, no. oddly enough, I have an unopened container of Chick Fil A sauce. Oh, look what we picked up. Look at that. The salsa. Bucky's peach chipotle. Ooh. And it's on. <laughs> I have a bigger blanket if you want that, no, if no. you're not comfortable. The official K&R tiny hands. Plus he had a, the dog had a coat, then we had another. You, you gotta represent the Raiders doing it, but you know. I, I don't wanna, I don't want you to be mad, but we don't watch football, so. I usually watch them lose. <laughs> so everybody, this is about to become a lovely tea party. Moment of truth. We're gonna fire this bad boy up and see what's cracking, shall we? No, you just you died in the fire. <laughs> Who's gonna start the fire? Me! Donovan! Donovan! What's the, wait, uh, what's that pirate joke? What's that joke? Oh! What is a pirate called treasure? Booty! <laughs> <laughs> and we're here with our friends, Texas Family Camping and Who? RV on the Wayside. Texas Family Camping. They're here? Yeah. Oh. You, you know. We came to this RV park because we had some friends from Kansas who also have a YouTube channel, KNR Destinations. They were headed down here to get away from the cold, blistery winter. A few more YouTube channels decided they wanted to come along as well. RV on the Wayside, as well as Jarhead and Ginger's Journeys were there too. 
We all had a great time sitting around and chatting with each other and cracking some jokes. Everybody good? Everybody's good? While we stayed at this RV park, we met our neighbors who were also from Kansas, and they were staying here for a month. They had gotten the rate of about $800 plus electricity for the off-season months. This led to our family having a lot of discussions about our choices in life. There will be more to come on that later.